Hey, what's going on everybody? Today I wanna to discuss what I think are the best general detailing stuff for your car, truck, van, whatever. Over years, I've always been trying to figure it out and I think in the last few years, I've used these only. And it's different brands, it's Adams, it's Trinova, Black Magic, 303, Meguiar's, Chemical Guys, no one manufacturer seems to make everything that's really top notch, in my opinion. Um, each one of them has some things that are the best. And like I said, I've washing, detailing, and stuff our cars for decades, and I've used many things. To start off, some good microfiber towels, and these I believe are 24 by 24. They have a smooth side, and then they have the plush side. And the people that make the best one of these are chemical guys. These are really nice. Just uh, here's a tip for you. If you're drying your car, even if you're using them to wash with, which usually use a wash mitt, but don't just throw them down on the ground, even on the concrete, and pile them up until you're done and pick them up because you can get little grit in here that gets stuck in here. Even when you wash them, that scratches your car. So the 24 by 24 chemical guy microfiber cloths, them are great. Right here, chemical guys, glass cleaner. Can't beat it. Really good. Really good. Um, I've used this uh, for, for several years. And it's uh, just one that you just can't beat. Okay, here's a double sword here. 303, which was once used in the aircraft industry, I believe. It's a very good UV protection. It lasts a long time. Great for seals and stuff, too. Uh, if you got rubber seals around your door or whatever, that's the stuff to put on them. Then you've got Meguiar's, which is a gloss shine, but neither one of these have leave a greasy filling. It cleans and shines. So if you don't really want a gloss and you want something that's going to last, six nine months 303 if you want a gloss shine maybe it won't last as long as this does this is mcguire's natural shine so it just depends no gloss gloss either one are fine same thing can be said here when we get to waxes the adams buttery wax that's really good stuff um you know, most people don't wax their car as often as they should. You do this two or three times a year. But I'm going to give you a trick in a second that's going to help either one of these. Do this two or three times a year. You can do this pretty quick, on and off. But if you really want to go nine months, maybe even a year, or you just want a deep, all the way down, hardcore, good wax job that's just really going to get into it. This next generation, Tech Wax 2.0, I found to be the best from Meguiar's. This is a really, you need to spend a couple hours and really get this on real good and follow the directions and you'll be rewarded with an incredible shine. And if you're going to do it a couple times a year, this one right here will be just fine. Either one of them. But it's just the Meguiar's that's going to be deeper and last longer. But the trick here is this stuff, Adam's Detail Spray. This brings back the gloss. The, it's almost like a sort of a wax type thing. But it's so simple. When you get through washing and drying your car, or not drying your car, when you get through washing your car and rinsing your car, just go around and give this a light spray on your wet car. Take your my microfiber cloth and dry your car. It's, that's all you got to do. So there's really no extra work to it. And this will extend the shine of either one of these considerably. That's why you can get away with once and twice a year and still have a very glossy looking shine. Again, when your car is wet, spray this on. More is not better, just a light spray. Take your towels, dry your car, you're good. Now this Trinova, is a recent one so I'm not gonna sit here and say it's the go-to thing but in the few times I've used it if you've got 
some faded trim like bumpers or um, the liners around your wheel well. This has done a pretty good job restoring it and it'll last a couple months. I've had good luck with it so far. So, so far, this one has done really good. And this Black Magic tire spray, you just spray it on, boom, you're done. You get a wet look. It claims it lasts three weeks, but really, two weeks is probably what you're going to get. That's a very simple wet dressing. And you don't have to get a bunch of stuff dirty or anything. You just spray it on. A light coat. That's my real choices among your basics. You know, if you're going to go spend 300 bucks and have a professional detailer do it, they're probably going to use something different. Who knows? I, I know ones that use Meguiar's and Adams and 303, so maybe not. There is one other thing here that's not pictured that you should know about because I ran out of it, so I, don't, I didn't save the bottle. I didn't think about it. Believe it or not, it's turtle wax, and it's called uh, bug and tar removal. You can't beat that stuff, and that's one I've, I've tried and tried extensively for years to find something that worked. Turtle wax, bug and tar removal. You can look it up online. It don't do nothing for tar, so if you're getting it for tar, you're wasting your money. But for bugs, just spray that stuff on and let it sit. Oh, you can't beat it. It takes off those bugs that are even stuck on and baked on. So turtle wax, bug and tar removal, but again, you're getting it for the bug. If you get it for the tar, it ain't gonna do much for you. So those and some good microfiber towels, good quality ones, you want good quality ones, those right there will work good for you. So that's just my choice and after years of trial and error and stuff and don't forget to use this after every wash or every other wash you'll be amazed at how the outcome is this Adams detail spray hey everybody take care and stay safe and we'll see you next time please share and subscribe have a good evening